What's up, everybody? It's your main man, DJ Ron the Mechanic here, back with another video, y'all. So, look, hey, before we begin, hey, look, make sure y'all like, comment, share, and subscribe, and don't forget to turn on that notification bell, so that way you won't miss a video whenever I drop one. So, look, I was out delivering today, and you know when you're driving, you know, you certain things catch your eye a little bit, you know, just like uh, last time, uh, what it was like, I think it was a couple, like a couple weeks ago when I was driving and I seen where they had throwed away some uh, some plant buckets. And I'm like, what? Hold on, I'm like, let me roll over there and get a few of them. So I did. So now, guess what? Same thing today, but this time it's not plant buckets that I found. Man, y'all ain't gonna believe it. <laughs> but uh, I think I might be able to put a little work on this one here. So look, I'm gonna show y'all what I found. All right, y'all. Y'all ready to see what I found? Y'all ready? Let's go ahead and take a look, man. Going up. Look at this right here. Yeah. Kind of found this. uh sitting on the side there, you know? I'm like, okay. Like, it's a little dirty, dirty there. You know, it looks like it has a little potential. Kinda messed up a little bit on the side there. So yes, I found this while I was out there all delivering the day, so they accident, well, evidently they pretty much throw this away. So I saw it, I'm like, shoot, let me grab this here. So for those that don't know, this right here is a, it's a subwoofer box, it's a band pass box, uh, which is, uh, you have a sealed chamber right here, and then you have a ported chamber right there. So it's actually like, kind of like two boxes in one, but to me that's, pretty much basically like a fourth daughter. That way you got a seal section and you got a ported section. So yeah, I was like, cool, man. I'm like, let me grab this here then, you know? So just by looking at it, like I said, yeah, it, it, it needs a little TLC there. Y'all can see that. By being all dirty and everything, you know, I'm looking at the carpet and all that there. You know, checking it out. Now, I'll tell you one thing, they use some uh some pretty thick wood there on the side there. Let's see, what is that? That's about an inch, I think. Let me check. Let's check it out. Yeah. Yep. Okay, so they went with one inch thick uh wood around there on, on the edges there, okay? All right. So that's a good little starting point. Something good to know. Uh this right here is the the the, the, the little plexiglass right here. See it got a few screws that go around keep it intact. Uh Hmm. Okay, so I can tell that right here they're missing a screw. Okay. So these are the ports. Okay. So I noticed the difference with the port is the two on the the two on the outside they are longer and the two in the middle are shorter. Hmm. Wow. So I'm trying to wonder, do these pop out? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna have to play around with that. See if I can get those out of there. See if they can, if they pop up, yeah, that'd be good. I'm pretty sure they do. Pop them up. Now, whoever had this, uh, 
I can tell they didn't, uh, let's say, take care of it too much. I mean, to be honest with you, I have never owned one of these boxes right here. You know, I mean, I done seen plenty for sale, like on eBay, pretty much, with the Wolfers in there. Uh, just by looking at it, It's not much space, being honest with you. It's pretty much like the box is like, let's say half off, whatever, you know? Uh, see, this is, like I say, this right here is the sealed section right here. So then you have the ported section back here. Nah, they have that section okay all right, they have a divider in between those. Hmm. Yeah, this is uh, interesting here. I'm going to have to see if I could find this company here or uh, online. Pretty much. I'm trying to see if I can find some information on this box so I could actually, like, find, you know, get the specs of it and see exactly what it's tuned to and everything. Uh, hey, like I said, I, it was outside, so, you know, they pretty much throwed it away, y'all know. But knowing me, I'm like, ooh, maybe I could do a little work on this thing, you know? Put my magic on it. Clean it up. Make it look worth something, you know? Hmm. And let's take a look at the back. Oh, my goodness. Come on, y'all. Really? <laughs> really? You mean tell me they couldn't order no uh, cups for these here speaker terminals? They don't cost that much. They could have ordered those from eBay and put those on. But instead, they cut a piece of board and screwed it into the back. And then they just what, ran the wire through there like that. And you can see that that's not properly sealed. Oh my goodness. Uh, and wait a minute, there's no wire on this side, or if they had any. Uh, from the looks like of it, they. Nope, they didn't. I know y'all seen seeing all the dirt and everything in there. So I'm like wondering how in the. You know what? They might have had some wire going through that side there, just like they did this. So right off the top, that tells me, I know whatever that they was using, it wasn't performing worth of nothing because with all that, you know, leakage right there of air and everything, so I, I'm, I'm pretty sure this shit wasn't, it wasn't doing nothing. It probably sounded like trash. Just by looking at it, I know it sounded like trash. So, yeah, I'm like, oh my goodness. So they got a screw right there. Did it go through? Nope. So, wow. <laughs> okay. That ain't no problem, though. I could fix that. That ain't gonna be an easy fix. All I'm gonna do is simply, I'm gonna pull that off. And, of course, I'm definitely gonna pull this carpet off. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm clean this up. Well, reverse it. I'm gonna pull all this old carpet off of here. Clean up the plexiglass. Uh, I can tell the inside. I'm gonna have to vacuum it out. Pretty much. Clean it up real good. Uh, let me see the inside section. Yeah, I'm gonna reseal all that back up. Now, first of all, you know what? By looking at this set, uh, I kind of noticed this side here is kind of kind of damaged a little bit. I ain't gonna say a little bit. Shoot, it's damaged a lot. Yeah, this part here is damaged a lot, yeah. 
And you know what that is. That's, that look like that's that MDF. Look at that. MDF that got wet on that edge. And look, it just, just brittle. Hmm. So with that in mind right now, hey, you know what I'm gonna do. My ideal is simple. Hey, once I get the carpet off of here, completely off, and that way I can see how bad the bottom is. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna restore that bottom part down there. I'm gonna pull that, gonna, like I said, once I finish that, taking all this carpet off, I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna buy another piece of uh, board, but I don't think I, I ain't gonna go with that, that MDF on here though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna change that up there. Probably go like some, uh, hey, what is that? Probably go like some, I'm gonna see if I can get some plywood, whatever, something that thick, if I can. Yeah. And replace that whole bottom, reseal it up. And then from that point on, then shoot. Then I can go ahead and uh, start customizing the box how I want it, pretty much. So yeah, this could be a nice little project, y'all. I'm gonna, how should I say it? I'm gonna try and work my magic on this here and bring this bad boy back to life. Yes. And see what it do. Cause matter of fact, yeah, this is a, yeah, this is a 212 box right here. Yep, it's for 212s. So like I said, now I have never owned a box like this. So matter of fact, I don't even know how it sounds at all. You know, I'm so used to the regular seal box or regular ported box. I have never owned Matter of fact, I have never seen anybody with one of these band pads boxes. So, I, like I said, I don't even know how it sounds with the woofers up in there. So, ah, once I get through rebuilding it, then I could probably get an idea because I actually do have an extra set of twelves, some Pioneer twelves. No, just you no know, sitting in the attic. So, guess what? I'm gonna make a new home for them. I'm gonna give them these right here. That gonna be the new home for the pioneers. Yep. So, yep. My work is cut out there. So yeah, we definitely got some work to do on this one here, bud, for sure. Not a, just knocking on everything else seems like it's you know, intact, whatever. It's just that, that bottom that's kind of messed, well, I ain't gonna say kind of, that bottom is messed up real good. So that's that's gonna be replaced all together and resealed up and everything. And then from that point on, I'm gonna put some ideas on this here. So yeah, this could be a fun project here. Yes. Then I'm pretty sure these here, this plexiglass probably got like a seal or something on it. If the seal is pretty good, I'll leave it like it is. But if not, then I'll reseal it. So that way it could uh, hold in pretty good there. So yeah, I got some ideas together for this here. So look, uh, I'm gonna do all that on the next video, showing me taking everything apart, cleaning it up and all that there. So yeah, I'm gonna take y'all on this uh, rebuild journey. So. Hey, so that's it for right now. So like I said, hey, look, turn your notification bells on and be prepared for the second video to this here. So yeah, we got some work to do. And look, I'm gonna share the little restore with y'all. Yeah, that's right, y'all. We gonna put them skills to work on this bad boy. We gonna bring it back to life. Yes, make it look like something. But don't you know though, a box this size, really, by me looking at it, they normally have a box like this for 212 by itself without it being a band pass. Cause I'm like, man, this is a pretty stout box here. Hmm. Yep. But hey, look, 
that's it though, y'all. Like I said, turn that notification bell on uh, so y'all can catch the next video that's coming up. Yeah, we're going to tackle this bad boy for sure. So, yeah, look, this DJ Ron Mechanic here. Hey, once again, make sure y'all like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. And once again, once again, once again, turn on that notification bell, y'all. Yeah. So, be on the lookout for the next uh, video for this part two coming. The work. The restore. Yes. That's right. All right, y'all. I'm out of here.